there's an elephant in the room, and it's called resistance. Resistance is a psychological defense mechanism that causes us to reject, deny, or oppose an action. Whether it's the outside life we live or the unlived life inside us, our passions and our dreams, it's human nature to resist. Stephen Pressfield, in his book, The War of Art, says that resistance is the most toxic force on the planet. It's the root cause of more unhappiness than poverty, disease, or erectile dysfunction. It crushes the human spirit and makes us less than we were born to be. And that's really boring because it causes us to make an endless list of excuses not to do what we want to do. I'm too old, I'm too young, I'm too fat, I need a nap. I think I'm gonna be busy today. I don't know anybody in that book club. My wife won't let me go. My husband will get mad at me. I don't like Mozart. Modern art is a bore. I don't drive 30 miles outside of Los Angeles. How do you beat resistance? You defeat resistance every day, every morning, one day at a time. Wake up with an intention to do the most important work. Something that brings you joy and satisfaction. Something that excites you, raises your temperature, fulfills a need. Make no mistake, resistance will be there every day. So be alert, be aware, be vigilant, and be clear about the action that you're going to take so that you can pursue your passion and your dream. If you want to write that novel, get up at nine in the morning. Writing isn't hard. Sitting down to write is hard. If you want to run the marathon, get up at six in the morning. Lying in bed won't get you to your goal. If you want to go to the gym and work out, well, that's not hard, but driving in the car is hard. You are the only one that can beat resistance. And you do that every day by not allowing those little excuses, those pesky little errands to get in the way of your most important work.